As a professional realtor, Amy Diwali believes consumers should have as much information as possible in order to understand their relationship with their realtor and the responsibilities and duties they are owed. This is why you're receiving this video outlining the Disclosure of Representation and Trading Services form. Before you disclose any confidential information to your realtor, you need to clearly understand what kind of business relationship you have. Real estate professionals can represent a consumer in one of two ways. As a client, the real estate professional will be working on your behalf as your agent. Your realtor will owe you special legal duties, including loyalty. Your agent will act only in your best interest. Full disclosure. Your agent must tell you everything they know that might influence your decision in a transaction. Avoiding conflicts of interest. Your agent must avoid any situations that would affect their duty to act in your best interests. Confidentiality. Your agent must not reveal your private information without your permission, even after your relationship ends. That includes your reasons for buying or selling, your minimum or maximum price, any preferred terms and conditions you may want to include in a contract. When you become a client, you may be asked to sign a written agreement setting out the agent's responsibilities and yours. As a non-client, a realtor does not owe you these special legal duties. No loyalty. The real estate professional may be representing a client with competing interests to yours. They must be loyal to their client and not to you. No duty of full disclosure. The real estate agent does not have a duty to give you all relevant information. No duty to avoid conflicts. The real estate professional is not acting in your interests. No confidentiality. The real estate professional must share any information you provide them with their clients in a transaction. As a non-client, a real estate professional may provide limited trading services, including providing general market information and standard forms helping to correctly fill out paperwork, and presenting offers and counteroffers. Whenever a real estate professional works with you in a real estate transaction, whether you are a client or not, they have a responsibility to act honestly and with reasonable care and skill. For more information relating to your relationship with a real estate professional, please visit the Real Estate Council's website at recbc.ca or ask any questions you may have. Once your questions have been answered, you can best determine how you'd like to complete the form. This will enable Amy Diwali of McDonald Realty to provide you with appropriate trading services.